And the first thing that you want to do is basically just to turn it on. And I think the thing that most people will be using is basically the prayer part of it. So what you're gonna have to do is actually just to click right here on select prayer. And then you just step right onto it. And it starts with the prayer. But apart from the prayer feature, it also has a lot of other features. For example, it has a lot of surahs that it can help you learn. If you just click on one of these, it will basically just read that up. And it also has these other features, uh, but it's basically pretty easy to use. You just have to click on each of these things that you want to do, and that's how you use it.